So oftentimes when people speak of risk management and medical tourism, they leave out protecting their website. So one question you wanna ask yourself is, is your website being legally protected? And one of the best ways of doing this is by making sure you have a privacy policy on your website. A privacy policy lets your users know what information you're collecting, as well as how you're handling their information, how you're protecting their information, and ultimately who you're sharing the data with. And since we are in medical tourism, and your website will be on medical topics, you wanna to make sure that your users know uh, that your site content is for informational and educational purposes only and should not be taken as professional medical advice. And the reason you wanna do this is because even if this person isn't your client, or even if someone isn't your client, they can go to your website, they can read your blog, and they can misuse the information that they read from your blog. And if they get negative effects from that, they could come after you or they can attempt to come after your business. So you wanna let everyone know that comes to your website, that your information is for educational purposes only, and that's to protect yourself, not only from people who use your service, but people who just visit your website and use your content. Another thing you wanna make sure you have on your website to protect it is terms and conditions. And your terms and conditions are just rules and regulations for visitors who use your website. Um, and it also protects you from people who are trying to copy your information and possibly use it on other platforms. Uh, and if you guys need a professionally designed website, we also provide website design services.